hi everybody and welcome back to our youtube channel loca priya here so today i'm very very excited about going snorkeling hi Zazie, yeah. you want to say hi you have your hi. bathing suit on yeah yeah mommy mommy <laughs> So we are heading out to go snorkeling. I'm very, very excited in the middle of the water, ocean. We'll be seeing some exotic fish, hopefully, finger crossed. So we wanna take you guys along with us to kinda like explore a little bit the area and see what the ocean has for us. So yeah, I'm excited. <laughs> you the cutest little mermaid? Yay! Yeah. Excited, we'll see if the water's not too choppy. And now the visibility is amazing. We see these amazing panoramic views of the coral reef. We're riding a catamaran, a big sailboat. We had feathers. We could fly instead of driving. We made it. Almost close to the boat. Mr. D. It's cold right now. It's windy. Yeah. Like goggles tied up the first time. Yeah. A little yellow fish um, and lots of uh, coral and sea anemone type thing. Oh my gosh. You okay? Yeah. Hey lovely Logan fam, we just got back from our snorkeling excursion. Uh, we decided to uh, go today even though they called and told us the water was going to be really choppy and the visibility was significantly reduced due to that significant surface turmoil. So we got on this big huge 70 foot catamaran and there was a decent amount of people on it um, and we got to go way out on the ocean. Luckily we took a little bit of Dramamine before so it didn't create too much motion sickness or seasickness. Um, but unfortunately I think it hit the kids, Manu and Ramani, a little too hard and uh, put them both to sleep. Manu was a little frightened of getting in the water. Uh, finally we arrived to the outer reef about 70 miles off of the shore and they docked. They had this amazing uh, steps that just descended in the middle of the boat down into the ocean and um, we decided to go down. Bhagavan and I went out first, swam way out to the ocean. Bhagavan had a little time having his mask seal around his face um, so it wasn't as a pleasurable experience as one probably would like but there were some amazing fish out there so uh, rainbow parrot fish, saw t blue tangs, all different colored tangs, yellow fish, orange fish, amazing sea kelps and uh, sea fans or whatever they're called blowing in the wind. Um, and going back was a little crazy, I had to swim against the current um, into the wind and then try and ascend 
this rocking boat with waves crashing and steps plopping up and down into the ocean. It was a little intimidating and then decided to grab Loka and take her down. Um, she wanted to change out her vest um, and got this weird uncomfortable vest that was riding way up high on her because of the buoyancy. So, and then had to walk down the steps and put your fins on and get into the ocean. Someone didn't even want to wear her fins for some reason. And then she got, because the water was so choppy and undulating, it was about a one and a half uh, foot choppiness. It was causing the steps to undulate up and down. And this one was scary to even get off the steps. It was gripping onto the rope and I was trying to pull her out and saying, let go and she wouldn't let go of the ropes. Um, and she felt like the water was pulling her. Afterwards, I asked her what she was, why she wouldn't get off the rope. She said she was afraid, to which I asked, afraid of what? And she said- The waves. <laughs> the wave, well, ocean was gonna s swallow her. I said, you have floaties on. <laughs> Finally, we got her off and her life jackets were riding, riding way up because she chose the wrong life jacket. Um, and we couldn't even swim to the reef because she didn't want to go out that far. But it was an amazing experience. I loved it. It was joy joyful for a family. First time, first time riding a bicycle. First time snorkeling in open <laughs> water. Snorkeling in open water. I did it all. And then the way back, everyone's wet. It was windy. We're going into the it wind. Was so it was so cold. cold. I'm glad we brought long sleeves to bundle everyone up um, because a lot of people were not dressed appropriately. Mm. All they had was a towel and bathing suits, and it I was felt cold, so bad cold, for them. Cold. Because everybody in the boat, most of, not everybody, but some people were just like showering because they didn't want a towel, long sleeve, anything. So they were expecting QS to be warm, but big surprise. <laughs> and then they were playing reggae music, a lot of that was so much dance fun. hall, um, Sean Paul. All right, guys, we truly hope you guys really did enjoy the video. If you do, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, and we will see you guys on the next vlog. Bye.